Ernst, they got patch notes for the November 24th is when this is happening. Is that on a Thursday again? It's going to be on a Thursday. Better. That's perfect. All right. So the next event will be happening on a Thursday. They got the new hero, uh, Lapli Lapis. Um, I know it says like, um, what's it called? She'll be having her own banner, right? She's a limited character, 4% rate as well. Like uh, the Helm banner with a 2% chance at her, 50-50 again. Um, you can get gold mileage tickets when recruiting in special recruitments. And you can exchange 200 gold mileage tickets in the mileage shop for 50 lapis modes. So if you did 20 multis, or I guess it would be 18 since they gave 20 free tickets on Helm's banner. If you already have 200 tickets... You don't need to summon if you want this character. You can just go to the shop and buy her, which I have. I'm still going to summon on the banner because if I pull her off the banner, then I just use my 200 tickets on the next banner, right? I'm just being smart with it. Um, But I'm probably going to summon on her banner. Like what I'm going to do, because I spend on this game, I'm going to summon on her banner every time I can summon on her banner and just keep trying to build up my pity and buy, like build up my tickets, basically. So that's that but like i said if you summon i guess 18 multis on helm's banner and you didn't use your gold tickets you could just use your gold tickets to pick her up right so that's nice her class is an attacker um she's a missileless character and uh her weapon is a hero or well, it's just a rocket launcher her weapon's a long a rocket launcher right so yeah this will be happening on the 24th as well um so that's good that's good. It goes. Oh. So it says when the special recruit ends on the 8th, Helm and Lapis will be available in both ordinary recruits and social point recruits. So, okay, they're not going to have Helm on the, like, I thought they were going to put Helm on standard banner uh, after her banner left, but she'll be in the standard banner and on the friends banner when this banner is done both of them will be so that's nice you can always just skip this banner too and to keep saving your thing if you want to try to pull them off a thing they're not pilgrim units so you have a better chance of pulling them than a pilgrim on standard banners but there's that new main story update chapter 17 and 18 will be available i'm telling you 90 96 percent of the game isn't even done chapter like 15 so there's no way but i mean it's, it's not bad it's content right i guess um it's nice to know they'll add more to story i should say um most of these games don't actually add more to story in terms of their uh i guess in terms of these types of games a new event high tech toy numerous mass production nuggets have gone missing after being sent up to the surface a uh, missile has a lot has lost the most mass produced units of all the big three the big three who would that be that would be uh laplace uh laplace drake and um i don't know who that else would be right um where was i and the company has experienced serious uh financial repercussions uh for this quarter the Métis squad has been sent to the surface to investigate. I guess never mind. The Métis squad is um, uh, Laplace, Drake, and whoever the last one is. I guess it's just probably those two actually. Uh, clear the stage to earn development materials. You will have a chance of a, you will have a chance of obtaining hero dice when you clear the event mission or use designated characters to clear the stage. Okay, that's good. Does this say the bonus characters? I guess it doesn't. Use the hero dice to take your first step onto the hero road with Lapis, a Nikkei who will stop at nothing to become the greatest hero the world has ever seen and earned all kinds of rewards. Mini game, hero road. Okay, so this is new. Uh, rolling the, oh, it's one of those. Okay, so it might be like one of those dice, like um, like like Monopoly type uh, game modes, I should say. If you know what Monopoly is, I'm sure you do. Rolling the hero dice will make Lapis move forward to, uh, to a tilt according to the numbers shown on the dice yeah so it's monopoly um i think what it is it's the same as the no callers id event but they also have this mini game in it because it says right there uh mini game as well right so i think it's the same as the no caller event with the like 
hard and normal stages but this one also has a mini game so it's it's a bit better i think um where was i landing on different tilts will grant different rewards you'll also get recruit vouchers advanced recruit vouchers and many other uh, awesome rewards based on the total numbers of times you roll the dice well so they're giving regular tickets and tickets for her banner that's nice um you go to lobby event high tech toy okay and then okay let me see lapis seven day signing event during this during the events in signing for seven separate days to earn high quality modes advance okay so it's good okay because we didn't get a login reward or a login like i guess login daily login whatever for helm right but we did have one for like the release of the game and at the end of like on day seven you got yourself a multi on the regular banner and i was saying basically this time we might get a multi on her banner because we couldn't buy her tickets so there has they have to be giving her tickets um free to play somehow and they are right so that's a big dub at seven days you probably get yourself a free multi very good unless they nerf it but i don't know um yeah and that event starts from the 24th to the 8th of a uh, thing new character package okay so okay we'll be we're introducing this new item to the cash shop for further details check the shop panel uh how to obtain cash shop limited time packages so they're going to have limited banners or limited packs for her finally they didn't have any limited packs for helm so i'll be picking up all those packs for sure new battle pass is going to be um you can earn high quality modes and recruit vouchers from the uh mission pass maxwell's new costume mechanic what can be earned by completing mission pass level 15 so maxwell is getting a new skin as well but let me see where it says this shop thing news um i don't know if it's gonna show here um I guess not. Unless it's in notice, maybe. Important. Yeah, no. So I, I don't know where. Uh, I maybe I have to go in game to see. I maybe I have to go in game to see. Let me check. Okay, I guess the shop will be there when it actually drops. So we don't know what that looks like yet. But there's that. And then I guess the last thing is they're going to be fixing bugs. I don't know if they're going to be fixing character bugs. It just says detail informing. Um, or detailed information regarding optimizations and bugs fixes will be given upon completion of the updates so i don't know what bugs are going to fix hopefully it's the units but um yeah i'm like i said i'm summoning i will get laplace i think she's a good character great character actually raw nice damage dealer the only character in the game with true damage so she's gonna hit hard very hard trust me and she's a rocket launcher user she's gonna hit hard as like because rapunzel's a healer and she hits hard so imagine what laplace could do well an actual dps damage dealer with true damage yeah no i'm summoning for it easily um but yeah that's gonna be it for these patch notes i'm out peace